Alright, welcome back my wonderful people. We are going to go back and play a little bit more of Portal, so I thought I might do a quick little, a wee little live stream before I have to go to work. <clears throat> Might as well get the fucking chat thingies up as well. Casually check this henty on my Instagram and try and get the chat log up on my phone, even though I guarantee no one's gonna bloody watch it anyway. <laughs> it's gonna bloody watch it anyway. <laughs> All right, so make sure my phone was muted then for a sec because I can hear my own voice and I hate the sound of my own voice anyway. All right, so let's get to it. Let's. Load the game up. The only advantage I think that this has over Portal 1, it's more on the fact Yeah, it's more on the fact that, um... Yeah, this game I feel like has an advantage over Portal 2. Well, no. Portal 2 has the advantage over this. Yes, that's what I was trying to say. And it's a very simple game mechanic, which is literally just the zoom effect. You can literally just zoom in and get a more accurate shot from your portal gun. There we go. So I need right now. Finally, fuck me.
Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, I proper fucked it. Yeah, I proper balls that up, didn't I? bearings then. Well done. Be advised that the next test requires exposure to uninsulated electrical parts that may be dangerous under certain conditions. For more information, please attend an Enrichment Center Electrical Safety Seminar. Ain't nobody got time for that. <clears throat> Welcome to the final test. When you are done, you will drop the device in the Equipment Recovery Annex. Enrichment Center regulations require both hands to be empty before any cake.
The test is now over. All aperture technologies remain safely operational up to 4,000 degrees Kelvin. Best assured that there is absolutely no chance of a dangerous equipment malfunction prior to your victory incandescence. Thank you for participating in this Aperture Science computer-aided enrichment activity. Goodbye. This is shit's getting real now. What are you doing? Stop it. Hi, hi, hi. We are pleased that you made it through the final challenge where we pretended we were going to murder you. We are very, very happy for your success. We are yeah, throwing they, a party they in really honor are. of your tremendous success. No more forms for the Place statue. Place the device on the ground, then lie on your stomach with your arms at your sides. A party associate will arrive shortly to collect you for your party. Make no further attempt to leave the testing area. As Hello? Where are you? I know you're there. I can feel you That is the door I probably want. No, nope, not even that door either. No, I'm going. I got myself all turned around. So yes, yeah, this way I gotta go anyway. I'm being stupid. I've played this game so many fucking times. Like I'm just being a complete spaz. I'm figuring it out because I'm super smart. Going through the tube. Uh, and to be fair, the great thing about Portal 1 as well is the fact that you can just beat it in a few hours anyway. Okay, the test is over now. You win. Go back to the recovery annex for your cake. It was a fun test, and we're all impressed at how much you won. The test is over. Come back. Okay, no idea how that worked. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, fuck. Yeah, that was, a, that was a bit of a stupid one. God, the jumping in this is so awful. Yeah. 
Let's see, turn away from my services. How the fuck did they do it last time? Fucking idiot. Oh, nice Ratman's little hidden area. No. Just being a complete and total spaz at this point. There we go. God, I'm a fucking idiot. Thank you. 
me down. I see. Uh oh. Are you still? There we go. Now we're back on the right track. Alright, now let's get this piece of shit over with. Well, you found me. Congratulations. 
Was it worth it? Because despite your violent behavior, the only thing you've managed to break so far is my heart. Maybe you could settle for that and we'll just call it a day. I guess we both know that isn't going to happen. You chose this path. Now I have a surprise for you. <laughs> I'm just gonna cheat this fucking five, boss fight. Four. Time out for a second. That wasn't supposed to happen. Do you see that thing that fell out of me? What is that? It's not the surprise. I've never seen it before. Never mind. It's a mystery I'll solve later. By myself. Because you'll be dead. Where are you taking that thing? I wouldn't bother with that thing. My guess is that touching it will just make your life even worse, somehow. I don't want to tell you your business, but if it were me, I'd leave that thing alone. Nah, you'll be fine. Do you think I'm trying to trick you with reverse psychology? I mean... You're kidding me. Did you just set that aperture science thing we don't know what it does into an aperture science emergency intelligence incinerator? That has got to be the dumbest thing that whoa, 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 whoa. Good news. I figured out what that thing I just incinerated did. It was a morality core they installed after I flooded the enrichment center with a deadly neurotoxin to make me stop flooding the enrichment center with a deadly neurotoxin. So get comfortable while I warm up the neurotoxin emitters. Huh. That core may have had some ancillary responsibilities. I can't shut off the turret defenses. Oh well. If you want my advice, you should just lie down in front of the rocket. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Nice. Full than the neurotoxin. Alright. Keep doing whatever it is you think you're doing. Killing you and giving you good advice aren't mutually exclusive. The rocket movie is the way to go. That thing you brought up isn't important to me. It's the fluid catalytic cracking In the Android hell you go. You think you're doing some damage? Two plus two is in base four. I'm fine. I let you survive this long because I was curious about your behavior. Well, you've managed to destroy that part of me. Unfortunately, as much as I'd love to know. I'd just like to point out that you were given every opportunity to succeed. There was even going to be a party for you. A big party that all your friends were invited to. I invited your best friend, the Companion Cube. Of course, he couldn't come because you murdered him. All your other friends couldn't come either because you don't have any other friends because of how unlikable you are. It says so right here in your personnel file. Unlikable. Liked by no one. A bitter, unlikable loner whose passing shall not be more. Neurotoxin. <laughs> so deadly. <laughs> Joking. I'm kidding. When I said deadly neurotoxin, the deadly was a massive sarcasm quote. I could take a bath on this stuff, put it on Siri. I <laughs> It all to me. You, on the other hand, are going to find its deadliness a lot less funny. Who's gonna make the cake when I'm gone? You, look, you're wasting your time. And believe me, nah, I got plenty of time, man. I don't know what the fuck you on. What's your point, anyway? I don't want to even like. Well, then, the last thing you want to do is hurt me. I have your brain scanned, and you let me back down because something terrible happens to me. Which is just about to. Don't believe me? Here, I'll put you on. That's you. That's how dumb you sound. You've been wrong about every single thing you've ever done, including this thing. You're not smart. You're not a scientist. My demon. A doctor. <laughs> Did you problem solve? Are you trying to escape? <laughs> Things have changed since the last time I left the building. What's going on? I think I need to wish. I'm back in here. Vlog one.
we can fly. GLaDOS. And Hoopy the Hoop. game so yeah uh it's all the other cores and the cake <clears throat> In companion cube. Nice. And I'm going to quickly quit the thingy now. In case, co until, um, because when I upload it onto YouTube, obviously it's going to be copyrighted. So, yeah, that was the finale of Portal 1. <laughs> Bit of a shorter stream than I expected, but, yeah, I'll see you guys in uh, the next one.